guys, I'm Davey Wavy. I have a really fun story for you guys. So in Palm Springs, behind my couch, hangs this picture. It's a vintage erotic photo that was taken in Palm Springs in the 1950s. Every time I walk by it, I always think to myself, like, what's the story here? Like, what happened that led up to this moment? So when I was buying it, I was talking to the shopkeeper and I was like, do you have any background on this image? Like, is there anything we know about it? And it turns out, that he was at an auction for a prominent politician and his family was auctioning off the the man's portrait, right? It was this big portrait in a frame. The shopkeeper actually just wanted it for the frame and he won that auction. So he said to the family, look, like I'm just gonna throw out the, the painting. Um, do you guys wanna keep this portrait? And so they're like, all right. So he was cutting it open and as he cut through the back, a bunch of vintage erotic photos came out that like, did this politician collect them? Like, was someone else just keeping them there? Who knows what the story is, but the family was really embarrassed and told him to keep the pictures. So he launched this collection of these vintage photographs in his, in his gallery in Palm Springs. And so I bought one of the prints, and of course now it's, it's on the wall behind my couch. So I asked him if he would give us permission to imagine the story that led up to this photograph, if we could film that. And he very graciously said yes, that we could. So thus began the process of us writing the whole story uh, that led up to this moment. The story that we created was that these two guys were two escorts who were double booked to fuck Rock Hudson, who was this closeted, like super masculine, heartthrob celebrity in the 1950s and 60s. He was like six foot four but also secretly gay in this like notorious bottom. So it was really fun to, to play with that and to bring that world back to life. And we had to get everything that was in the photograph. Like you look on the ground, there's records that they're listening to. We had to find those records online and purchase them, the furniture, even the fabric of the curtains behind them. All these details we had to, to bring to life. And if you look at the photograph side by side with what we created, it's striking like how similar they are. But we had to bring the whole world to life, not just that room. So we found a house that hadn't been touched since the 1950s and we had Wesley Woods and Max Adonis be the characters in it. We had to dress them in wardrobe. It was so fun and I'm so excited about the story when we finally finished it that like yes it's explicit and it's juicy and it has to live on Hammerose TV because there's a lot of dick and there's a lot of cum but I also really really wanted to share the story with you guys so I uploaded a PG-13 version minus the dicks and the cum shots on my main channel on YouTube so I'll link to that down below. Hopefully you guys are subscribed to my main channel. Maybe you don't even know that I have one. Well anyway Click below and you can check it out. Make sure you do subscribe. If you do want to see the explicit version, then you can go to Hammerose TV. You can actually also just watch a free preview there if you at least want to see a little bit of the dicking that eventually happens. So yes, it was a lot of fun, uh, and I, I'm just in love with this whole story, and I'm really excited to share with y'all. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, more to come.